There aren't many best of lists where pivotal po political speeches sit comfortably alongside a rocking pub anthem. The National Film and Sound Archive has just added 10 historic recordings to its register of iconic Australian sounds. There are Prime Ministers aplenty and one musical institution. Long before the apology, there was the admission. The failure to bring much more than devastation and demoralisation to Aboriginal Australia continues to be our failure. One critic called it rhetorical overreach, but it reached out too. It conveys the feeling, the fantastic feeling, um, with the people, the crowd who was there, and it was just um, history in the making. The famous sounds added to the list this year span Australia's darkest hours. Fellow Australians, it is my melancholy duty to inform you officially that in consequence of a persistence by Germany in her invasion of Poland, Great Britain has declared war upon her and that as a result, Australia is also at war. And its brightest triumphs. Gold! Go to Australia! Gold! There's the Sydney Symphony Orchestra's first performance in its glimmering new home. And tunes to trigger a few memories. It brings back memories, doesn't it? Of this, when you first heard that song, what you were doing, you know, um, uh, what the world was like when, when uh, the, the sound was new. From things, big things glow. The sounds are proof history is not just written, but sung and spoken too. Siobhan Henew, ABC News, Canberra.